Good morning. From this beautiful morning at Dreamlex. Sun's coming through that gap beautiful right in front of me. Really carpy time. Wind's still pushing up that right hand side, which is exceptional because it was meant to change. I'll check it again today. I think it's gonna change though. Uh, up there, been a few fish out from here. Obviously you've seen my fish that I had just as it went dark last night, about half 10, 11, I think it were, from what I remember. Could have been later. Uh, had another run this morning, probably about half past five. I ate it, nothing there. Well, it stopped as I got to it. I still ate it and it was gone. So I put it back, back out. Morning, Daniel. Uh, I put it on the clip. It hits it, but I've just got a feeling it's not right, but I've looked at the line which way it's going and it's going right in the same spots where I've been wanting to go, so possibly be all right. You don't want to risk bringing it in now at this time, so it might have gone, I'm just, I just, I don't know. Right and rod still bang on the money from when I had the fish. Uh, funny enough, this morning, about 10 minutes ago, I had, like, it pulled forward an inch, I'd say an inch exactly, the indicator, and it stayed there. Uh, I brung it back now. And it's happened. I know a fish is still in that swim. We're blowing on the right hand rod now as well. It's hard to see. I'll see if I can show you. So it's in front of the white van. Them two patches there. So, yeah. There's a feed going on out there. Just open for it to happen. This is bike time. Uh, there's been a couple more fish, like I say, out. I think Darren had one, Tom's had one. Uh, so it could be three out overnight. Late one were very quiet. There was a fish out, like I say, this morning. Uh, I think Emo had one. 36 or a high 30. I expect fish out in next hour. Definitely. We're not going for a live uh, run now. I'm just giving you an update what's going on. That was magical yesterday when that happened. Yeah, Mark, uh, after that fish that I had last night, and then it went quiet, and then I had that run this morning. I've had a bit of a take as well. Like I say, it moved forward about an inch, the indicator. I know that they're in the area. Slowly, slowly building up the collection from the 40s, 150 and a 60. So if we get another 50, I'll be made up as well. And then uh, we'll go on to the big girls, which I've got my eyes on, definitely. We're dreaming about it. Be mint if that happened. So today, uh, what's it called? I'm not getting any breakfast. It's coming to my swim. Getting dropped off, so I'm gonna sit it out again. So at least four o'clock. It looks good. Good morning, Carl. Don't forget to add your people, add your mates to the group. Uh, spread the word about what we do. Book venues up and down the country in the UK. We do French trips as well. One a year at least. As we get busier, we may add two. You know, just uh, invite your friends to the group on the page. Some interesting stuff for you. Plenty of events coming up for next year. And uh, you can also follow us for the rest of the year with the events that we've got. Boric up north, Bantons up north, and then we've got uh, in Essex the quarry fishery. And then next year we've got some awesome venues for you again. Uh, 
I just had the one call uh, last night. I don't know if you've seen it. Let us know if you've seen it. Morning, Dean. So I've done that pack of Cronenberg. I want it next one. Today. Looks like it's going to be a warm one again. Morning, Michael. Got the fishing bug, I'm absolutely buzzing. I just don't want to go. Sat here thinking, what can I do next? Yeah, that's it, Carl, that's all I had. Uh, lost one this morning, sort of thing. Bit of a take, but it stopped when I got to it, just as I about to pick it up. So I put a new rig on, put it back out. Good morning, Dave Benyon. What are you recovering, mate? Feeling a little bit better or something? There's a few pictures there for you to uh, crack on with if you can get on it. If not, no worries. Uh, it's looking good. It wasn't cold last night again. We're decent. We just need other people to catch. Uh, hopefully we're going to move on the bait. I think I need to check and see if this wind's going to change. If it does, a few people need to stay, stay where they are and I think they'll come. If not, some people need to make that decision about moving uh, into some kind of different swim to see if it opens it up a bit. It's the only thing I can think. I've seen a few prayers, just hoping like it happens. I just need everybody to catch, that's the thing, and then we'll be happy. Oh, Dave, mate. Hope it eases off soon. I gather it's bound to be like that, innit? Topped up with them painkillers and that. So yeah, I've got to get my bait out again soon and start air drying it and start all the process of preparing the bait for the day. See that you washed out ones, I've changed the water yesterday evening. We don't get the cell in the liquid. Let's give them a stir up. You see there's plenty on that still. All gooey. And then you've got the essential cell which is starting to stick together. I need to get through this today, and then I can open up the new bags and get them out ready. So preparing stuff for today. It's all about the preparation as well. If you're on the fish, have the bait ready to go. Bigger operation than what you thought there have yet. It was serious. Good luck abandoned. Well, all you can do is stay at home, feet up, watch the live streams and stuff like that, Dev. Get some food down you and that. But yeah, uh, there's been some wicked fish coming out. It's been awesome. We still need some more people to catch, like I say, and then we've been met up. But you know what it's like? It can be quite difficult when very, very good anglers are struggling as well. I'm fishing 15 wraps towards the white van to the right of the sun. There are two rods on there, but you can see the line, which way it's going. And then my left hand rod's just there, uh, 10 wraps, basically, there. And I had nothing on that. I had that one on that live stream last yesterday evening, tea time on it. That's about it. It's gone quiet since then. So yeah, uh, back home, I bet you're all probably getting ready to go to work and stuff like that. We're at Dream Lakes. This misty morning, give you an idea what it's like for the fence. No, I'm not fishing far out. Uh, I can't remember who's, I think Damon's fishing the beach. Sure he is. He's had two fish, or somebody is. I was speaking to yesterday at tea, but he hadn't had anything at the fish in the beach as well. 
struggling. So right, I'm going to come off this video and speak to John a minute because it's important. Uh, yeah. Big shout out to my man. He's been fishing up there and uh, we're going to, going to talk while on live stream anyway probably. Did you hear them fish bashing up there last oh, night? Yeah. On the far margin down yep. the bottom. Were there any in front of you bushing there? Yeah, yeah, they were there, yeah, weren't you? Yeah. The most the most action without catching a fish I've had since I got here. Yeah, we were bushing last night like yeah, that yeah. crazy. And in between us they were there as well, weren't yeah. they? Yeah. Did you see the fifty that I had? Beauty, fifty. I was gonna come and wait you up, but I thought better not. Yeah. No, another beauty, mate. Mm. So yeah. I'm gonna come off this live stream anyway and speak to him.